To make the transition from California to the Caribbean, Zuck used a transportation orb, which sounds like something you'd find in a kid's sci-fi flick of the flight of the navigator variety. It's essentially just an interactive, 360 video backdrop that allows you to transition from one virtual environment to another. As Zuckerberg explains in the stream, Facebook is doing its part to help hurricane victims on the island. Aside from monetary assistance, it's also offering its A-assisted maps to aid search and rescue teams on the ground. These come in three shapes and sizes. The first uses Facebook's existing tech to create our location density map to indicate where people were stationed before and after a natural disaster. The second reveals movement data between cities and neighborhoods during set time periods. And, the third taps into the company's safety check tool to show the areas where clusters of people are marking themselves as safe. Facebook is sharing the maps with the Red Cross in Puerto Rico, and in collaboration with tech nonprofit NetHope. Elsewhere, it's using the same software as part of its global internet delivery plans. Like a regular Mr. Peabody and Sherman, Zuck, and Wire then zapped themselves to the Oculus Connect stage, and then the moon. The CEO should be back on Earth in time for the main event on Wednesday, where he'll announce plenty of new VR updates.